The Senate has considered a bill seeking to upgrade their existing mobile forces training camp in Monkara, Borono State, to a special forces training academy. The bill, sponsored by Senator Arlen Dume, scaled second reading on the floor during plenary. Senator Ndume, in his lead debate, said there was no special forces training center in the country and with the present security challenges, there was a need for the creation of the training school. There is mobile training camp in Limankara established 34 to 40 years back, which is known as a training center for mobile police. And we felt that there is no special forces training center in this country. And there is the need, especially now, where we, fa we face various forms of challenges, to have an institution or academy where special forces, not only of the Nigerian police, but other security agencies can be used to train special forces. As it is now, the Army, Air Force, Navy, and other security agencies normally send their personnel for training, uh, special training, because of the situation we find ourselves. And you find out that most of them have to send these people to even countries outside, and even countries like uh, West African countries that are smaller than Nigeria, because there is none in the country as it is as present. So that is what brought the idea of converting the uh, mobile training camp in Limankara. A cross-section of lawmakers backed the bill, reiterating that the Nigerian police deserves all the support that is needed to improve the security architecture of the country. Mr. President, there is no amount of money or institutions that could be said to be enough in tackling the problem confronting our nation today. More than any time in the history of our nation, we are passing through serious security challenges. And all over the world, Mr. President, there are innovations and improvements on facilities and institutions of learning. In the world today, globally, academically, Mr. President, most institutions now run specialized courses. Today, Mr. President, many people accuse the police for so many wrongs. Why? It is due to the fact that there are no enough professional institutions to train the Nigerian police. I think, Mr. President, that this bill deserves the support of all of us and all other uh, re uh, requests that we make the Nigerian police to be effective. A lot has been said about the need to improve the security architecture of this country and nothing can be too much to do given the existential threat that uh, security has posed for, for our country. It is important to also underscore from a resource optimization point of view that any bill that aims at converting and upgrading existing facilities into sustainable institutions that can serve better is, is a laudable one because we are talking of an existing facility that has the potential to cater for more than it is currently doing. It's not asking for uh, establishment of a new institution, but in enhancing an existing institution to do more. We have already police, uh, we have a police, uh, pol a police institution. We have other agencies of government that handle everything that is stated here. I don't see any reason why we will be bringing up something of this nature that's already taken care of. We have other institutions, we have police. This is normal routine duty of police. The DSS are, are there, the NIA are, uh, is there, the, the DMI, all of them. These, all these things he repeated here are all in, in that place. But if this is for the purposes of uh, just uh, uh, to special election for uh, because of this election purposes. Well, we may allow it for the second reason, but if not, I don't think this thing should go beyond this. Uh, this thing. we should bury this one here, and for that, there's no need for this. It's a surplus age. The view was referred to by the Deputy Senate President Ovi Omoagege, who presided over plenary. Establish the Nigerian Police Special Forces and the Nigerian Police Special Force Training School and its governing council and for other related matters there with 2022. Second reading taken. The bill is referred to the Committee on Police Affairs to report back in four weeks. 
Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.